The European Union has taken steps to sanction members of Niger's military junta, marking a significant development three months after they seized power in a coup. On Monday, October 23rd, the EU Council announced that it had taken steps to adopt a framework that will allow it to impose sanctions on individuals and entities seen responsible for actions that threaten the peace, stability and security of Niger. These sanctions will target individuals who undermine the constitutional order, democracy or rule of law in Niger, the Council explicitly stated. Sanctions will also be imposed on those involved in human rights violations or abuses. Travel bans, asset freezes and restrictions on the provision of funds to sanctioned persons will be included in the range of sanctions. The EU Foreign Policy Chief, Joseph Borrell, underlined the organization's support of ECOWAS efforts and sent a clear message that military costs have a cost. However, the European Union has left room for humanitarian exceptions to freezing assets.